Okay, everyone, welcome back to season seven, episode one. Got a little concerning thing that I've done. I've done a little something, right? Um, I found eleven lost each region, and I signed them, which means we now have five foreign players. Now, of course, I've only agreed to do four because I've lost my. I can't go above eighty k for wages. Right, so I'm gonna put one of them out on loan. This is Levinovsky's region. There's a reason why I signed them, guys. He's eighty rated and he's seventeen. So I'm thinking. Right, I, I did say I wanted to sell the Steli, but if we don't have uh, a centre back that we can play there in Castelli's place, because who's gonna play there? Like Fagan, shit. Uh, we could probably argue Collins to go there, or like we play McMullen uh, centre back instead. Oh, that's actually a good show. That's actually a really good show. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, but at least then, then where do we put where do we put Lewandowski's regen then? Right, on right wing that that kicks Leahy out, and Leahy seems to be somewhat good. We'll, we'll put people out on loan. We'll, we're gonna put everyone out on loan, and I'll see what the team's looking like, and then we can always recall people. Um, we'll leave Caselli there for now. Uh, who am I thinking about putting out on loan? McAllister, I'm thinking of putting him out on loan. Actually, we're going to give him a new contract first before I do anything. Um, Foley, we'll go out on loan. Nesbitt, we'll go out on loan. Uh, Leahy, we'll go out on loan. And so will uh, Lewandowski's regen. Or at least we're going to try and we'll see what happens. He'll definitely get an offer. He's really good. Um, he's going to be the next superstar of this team. I think if we have a chance to get rid of Rubio, maybe I'll accept it. But I'm kind of happy with Rubio. Oh no, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Right. Offers. Loan to buy. No. Phillips. Uh, you're not going anywhere. I rejected the Ryan deal. Swap deal for Jesse Lingard. That wasn't happening. An uh, actual transfer offer for... Yeah, no, guys. Why are you giving me transfer offers? They're on the loan list. Well, some of these players are on the loan list. Some of them aren't. Why? Jesus. And also, I realized how depressed I sound in the last video. Uh, that's... I actually was in a good mood during that entire video. Yeah, I sounded like I want to fucking kill myself. Um, yeah, so my apologies about that. If anyone even still watches this. I was not depressed in that video. I was actually genuinely happy. I was just trying to stay calm so I wouldn't start shouting like I have been in a lot of these videos. And then I sounded like I wanted to shoot myself. So, apologies about that. Oh, a loan deal. Oh, it's an option to buy. Bollocks. Two-year loan deal for... Lewandowski's regen. We're going to accept it, but we can always recall him back, so I'm not too concerned with that. I don't know why Collins is on the loan list. He shouldn't be. Nesbe, um, Yeah, that's another loan to buy. Uh, rejected offers for Coyle as well. Mm. Hmm. We just want to see if Colo goes first. Yeah, Colo's loaned out so we can keep Castelli for now. Nesbe offer? Oh, I don't really want to let him go. I want to let him out on loan. Right, we're going to start rejecting these offers now. Oh, Jesus Christ. hundred. How much can we get for him? We'll see, we'll see. We'll, uh, just just an inquiry there. Um Ramos's regen better start going up fast because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deal with him for too long. At the moment, Castelli is higher rated. So I kinda wanna see a bit of improvement. Alright, well, that's deadline day over. And the only person that we managed to get out was Lewandowski's regen. No one else wanted to go. A little late for transfer offers now, like I'm not even gonna bother looking down at that. What's the point? Anyway, he's called monthly report. Let's have a look. Meehan is... Oh dear. 40. Like, what am I supposed to do with a 40 rate player? Ennis has potential. Morrissey definitely has got potential. I want to have him in my centre-back line. I want to confer him to, defend, or to a centre-back. So Collins doesn't actually have to play, or McMullen doesn't have to play there. Uh, what players are we going to put into our academy? I don't think there's going to be anyone from this one, because usually the first one of the season is usually quite shit. And that backs it up. Nice. Okay, so, as you already know, you have got Real Madrid in the Champions League, remaining 16. Uh, that's not a surprise. So, I'm playing the second team against Sligo, and then the full team against Real Madrid. All right, who's going to get the first man of match of the season? I think it's going to be Connor Nose. Let me just whip out my documents. Oh my god, we lost. Wow. All right. That's epic. Lost our first game of the season. So, we're not going to beat him this season. 6.6, 6.8 from Doyle. Okay, what's going on? What a no scale. 6.1. Okay. Mark Doyle gets the first man match of the season. Uh, that's not gonna that's not gonna last with 6.8. Rain 16 gets Real Madrid. It's the team. It's the strongest team that I believe I can put out. This is like my first team. Collins is literally 
like has his head in the door with both legs and it's just his hair sticking out of it. That's the only reason why he's not in the team. Uh, yeah, so Asensio and Caselli, their places are a bit rocky at the moment because McMullen can play centre back and I want Collins in the team. Uh, this is my first time in the remaining 16 Champions League. It's the first time I got out of the Champions League group stage. In fact, I think this is my first time in the Champions League group stages. Uh, don't don't quote me on that. I think it is. Well, we're going to see what we can do here against Real Madrid, one of the favourites for the tournament. Uh, I am a bit scared. The room is getting a bit stinky, can't lie. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Oh, McMullen is absolutely busting down here. I have a shot. Ah, oh, that, was, that was unlucky because there's... They just got back so fast. Like I was looking at Rubio. I probably should have passed it earlier if I wanted an actual chance to get the ball to him. A bit greedy for me, but they just got back so fast. McAllister hit that. Oh, oh my god, he nearly scored. Uh, if his touch had been better there, he might have got enough to get it in. His first touch was shocking. But that was a... Which I think Courtois had to make a save. He did. He actually had to make a save there. That's, uh, that's some brilliant work there. Oh, oh the header was shit. Alistair, first time cross to Rubio. Oh, yes. What a goal. Oh, we're winning up against Real Madrid. Oh, the brilliant ball from McAllister. That was fantastic. And a nice tidy header from, from Rubio there. To get in the back of the box. Net, even. Jesus. Ayala setting up the pass. McAllister, nice first time cross. Oh, that was so good. Advantage, Dridaha against... Um, Madrid. Half time, 1 0. We really did score on the stroke of half time. Well, I was not expecting this, but I'm more than willing to accept this 1 0 result. And PSG are beating United. Jeez, really are coming up against some massive teams. Ayala right, hit that. It's free. Oh my god, it fucking fell from. Look at this bullshit. Oh, if this had happened to me, I would have been going absolutely mad. Just watch this replay for the, the retarded bounce that happens with Rubio and whoever that centre back was. Oh my god, I'd go absolutely mad if that happened to me. Just keep watching. This here. That look at that. Oh, I'm taking it. We absolutely needed a bit of a cushion here. It's only a matter of time until Real Madrid score. But oh, that's beautiful. 2 0, Grada United. Alright, we fucked up. I've, I've dived in with coil. Sensio, it's all down to you. Ramos is regen. Oh, fuck. Oh, the new score. We got away with that. We got so lucky there. Oh my god. What is happening? Right, kick out here to get in my way. Grant, okay, we got away with that. And kick out is out of my face. You love to see it. Leahy, I could probably do what you, you know, running. You know, a bit of an overlap there would have been very handy instead of just going backwards. Brian hit that with your right foot. Oh, I don't think that was going in, but, you know, we got a corner out of it, so look, there's positives here. Any. Defenders or something like that, and we can take off. I just realized that our bench is fucking shit, so no, I'm not taking anyone off. Rubio, I need Leahy to make some moves. He is kind of doing that, just badly. Phillips to Ryan. Oh, my phone's, my phone's going off, not my alarm. Oh no. Don't worry, lads, with the alarm going off, it's scramble score. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, the quality of this channel is. For fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, I see Rubio. Go on. Hit that. 3 0. 3 0. Oh my god. The alarm has actually helped us there. Oh, what a. What an alarm. You love, you love to hear it. Android alarms. Am I right? Yeah, Kit Kat's also here having a little fit on my desk. I'm not happy. I think she's a little Real Madrid fan. Losing. Alright, make some changes. Coyle's going right wing, McMullen's at right back, Collins is on the left back, Leahy is potentially going at right left wing. No, we're gonna put Nesbitt there. Uh, Ayala or Phillips could probably do a coming off, but we're gonna we're gonna hold off on that for a little bit. Although they probably should be coming off within the next few minutes. I want Heaney on the pitch to replace Phillips, but not yet. Ball to Ayala. Rubio's here. Uh, back to Ayala. Oh, I passed behind him. Not what I wanted at all. Rubio, that was a terrible pass. Remember, we've got fucking Lewandowski's regen now. Oh, we've just won. We've just won 3 0 against Real Madrid. Oh, fuck. Oh, what a result that is. We might have just done enough now. I'm probably talking a little too soon. 
but he might have done just enough to get through to the quarterfinals in the first leg. Oh, Rubio gets a 10. Ayala gets a 9.9. Odomosu also gets a 10. How many saves did Odomosu make? Shots against, he made 6 saves. His save success rate is 100%. Um, Ayala's, or sorry, Rubio's shot accuracy is 100%, and he scored 2 goals. He had 2 shots, he scored both of them. He has 1 assist. I think we're going to give it to Rubio. I, ah. Uh, yeah, I kind of feel bad for Odomosu there because he should. Well, I don't know because the game seems to give it to Odomosu. Fine, we'll go with what the game says. We'll, we'll do what the game says. It's Odomosu's man of match. Right, we're putting the first team out again against Bohemians as we do need to win in the league. Uh, let's see if Rubio can get his man of the match that he's been begging for. Uh, we draw one all. Oh, fuck's sake. Brian, no, Collins, no. Fagan with a 6.8. Wait, hold on a second. Fagan. Okay. No, Collins, 6.9. Okay, Collins has a 6.9. That's that's class. First team is playing against Waterford. We should win. We've lost. We've drawn. Now there should be a win. There we go. All right, I'm looking at Rubio with 8.3. Finally, your man, Unai Rubio, gets his man match. Now, it's not exactly the 10 that I thought he should have got against Real Madrid, but... You know, he's at least he's on the sheets now. I think Collins and Doyle aren't going to get any more this season. But I think Odomosu and Rubio will definitely have at least five come the end of the season. Uh, you squad want to report. And my phone's going off. Nice. Let's have a look at this. Meehan's terrible now. Honer is terrible. Let's get rid of him. Ennis is unfortunately falling down the pecking order to the point where I don't want him anymore. Meehan will get rid of. Uh, Morrissey. Oh, he's so close to being promoted. And McFay is being promoted. Should I promote him? Wait till he's 60. Uh, youth squad report. Let's have a look. Yeah, we'll promote this dude. We're not going to check these guys in the youth academy. I don't see the point yet. Uh, not much point. Jack McKay. Yeah, no, if they were like a million or something, then we'll have a look. But they're not. So we're not going to shit the bed over that. Right, the second team's been wheeled out against Finn Harps because we have the second leg of the Real Madrid game coming up now. And uh, I kind of want to win that. You know, if, I mean, imagine I win the Champions League this season. Oh my god, that would literally mean... Oh, we could also win the Super Cup as well. Jesus Christ. And Adiemo gets a 9.8. Wow. Okay, it's, I think it's been a long time since Adiemo has actually gone a man the match. I'm trying to look for his last one. It was in Season 5. So, yeah, Jesus. Jordan Adiemo with a 9.8. Right, full team against Real Madrid. I am recording this video in two parts, so this is going to be the last game of the first part. And then the second part will be what happens afterwards. Uh, I will probably end up simming this because I've got work. So I'm pushing myself for time again. I keep doing that. My apologies. So yeah, we're going to try and... If I score, I'll probably just jump to a sim. I'm not going to quick sim it by any means. Because uh, this is Real Madrid. But let's see if Rubio can get his man the match against Real Madrid. That might be the, the ongoing meme of this career mode from now on. Hello. I don't mind Odomosu again. I wouldn't mind if Odomosu became captain again. Because I do actually like Odomosu. Oh, chance here. Hit that. Oh, there's been literally no movement up top from Rubio at all. He's been absolutely shocking with his movement. He's not getting a man of the match unless he scores. The only way he's going to get man of the match. Because his movement has been shocking. His passing has been non-existent. I think he's made one pass, which was two Phillips there. That I showed. Um, yeah, he's not been very good at all. Which is a bit unfortunate. Because I kind of need him firing on all cylinders here. Well, not necessarily all cylinders. But I just need him to show up. You know, provide, provide sorry, a little bit of support for, for for the rest of the team. He seems to be struggling a bit in nearly every department. Although, there we go. He's got a pass there. He actually dropped back. Oh, McMullen's robbed that. Hit that. McMullen. Oh. Near post. I would have gone far post if that, was, if that was me there. But I'm not professional in any way. Professional cringe lord, actually. Yeah, I am professional, I suppose. Hit that. Go on. Oh. Phillips nearly scored twice. Oh, we need a goal. I think. Might be 3 0 up, but this game is not over. Well, this tie, I suppose, is a better way to say it. Ayala, I need you to move there. Oh, good ball. Good ball. Hit that. Oh. We need a goal. He just didn't accelerate. He didn't accelerate at all. We could have got away there. I don't know what was happening. Right, we're half time and we're still nil nil. I'd be happy enough for that. Maybe a one nil to me. 
Uh, Rubio. I see you, Leahy. Oh, fuck's sake. What is happening? Leahy, just cross it. You might as well just do something. Oh, I don't know where the ball is. Okay, no, we have the ball. Oh, jeez, what an absolute mess that was. I literally couldn't see anything. The half time? Yeah, okay. Jesus Christ, that was a mess. Alright, second half starts. It's nil nil. Oh, oh boy. Here they come. Sally, you blocked that. Oh, don't pass it back. Asensio, do something. Jesus fucking Christ. I think that was Caselli and Asensio again messing around at the back. Although, to be fair, they've been quite decent today, but... Oh, dear. Good save, Otomosu. He looks like he wants to get man the match again. All right, here we go. Cross it to Rubio. Oh, great defending. Rubio hit that. Oh, great save from Courtois. Although, I suppose it was kind of Adam. Now, we'll give him credit. Good save. All right, so Foley, Nesbitt, and Collins are on for McMullen, Leahy, and McAllister. Right, I'm going to try to get Ayala to score here. Oh, that was a nice shot. I didn't see that coming. We can get one goal here. I know we could probably sim it and still win. But, I want to get a goal. And we're not going to get that from Simina. I think this game's over. Yeah, I think this game's done. Right, I'm after finishing the game there. I just quick sim the Because there's like a minute left. Who have we got? Phillips with a 7.3. 7 That's a bit low. That's a bit low for that game. Really? Courtois gets an 8. Okay, yeah, I suppose Courtois gets an 8. Yeah, that's fine. Tell us what, 7.3. Okay, I don't I don't like that score. Like, Killing Phillips getting it, that's fine. But 7.3 is just so low. I, I don't... No, that's not fair. Right, well, that's where that game ends. PSG beat United 4-2 in aggregate. Yeah. Uh, we beat Real Madrid 3 0. Atletico beat Dortmund 3 1. Liverpool 2. Beat Sevilla 5 4. Oh, there's more? Oh, they haven't played. Okay. Right, well, this is the second recording of Season 7, Episode 1. And. Yeah, we're back at it. This is after work. We fucking lose again. Okay, right, we might be in trouble. Um, yeah, we'll probably end up in the league again. But I want to do Invincible. I want to go Invincible. And we're not doing that at the moment, and I don't like it. Now, uh, Chris Leahy is man the match there with a 6.5. Alright, Alan Brown has been replaced by Jason Knight. There we go. That's the that's the international squad. It's the same as normal. Right, I don't know why I played the second team there, because we didn't actually have any good... What the fuck is this? Yeah, go on. Fuck off. Alright, I don't, I don't care. The training is boring and shy. Uh, the one where they... He actually got to set the players yourself. I think that was a bit better. I think you can do the same thing here, but it's fucking... I don't know. I don't like the training aspect of it. I think it's a bit boring. Anyway, we should win because it's the first team. If I have to play a fucking domestic game, I'm not going to be happy. I'm going to be pretty fucking pissed. And Nesbitt gets man to watch. Why is Nesbitt on the fucking pitch? He's not supposed to be on the pitch. He's not even getting his first name on it. I'm not putting him on the fucking graphics. There's no point. He's not going to get another one. He might get one, maybe two more. Fuck's sake. Right, this is the team we're going with for Scotland. This is their second time playing Scotland in the group. I uh, will show the table after this game, if I remember. Hopefully I will. All right, let's just get into it rather than just talking. As I have a habit of talking. It's very annoying. I don't mean to do it. Oh, I just moved the mic there. It's going to sound fucking awful. Anyway, let's do this. You know what, Devoy, have a shot. Oh my god, he's actually fucking scored. The bloke that's still at Bohemians, I'm almost certain, has just scored an absolute screamer. A thundercunt, if you will. What a nice goal that was. Holy shit. I'd like to have a, I'd like to have a nice little replay. Go on, let's have a look at this again. This was really good. I have a feeling my controller's going to die soon. Probably put it on charge. Oh, what a goal. Oh, he's actually lobbed the keeper from, like, what... Oh, what is that? Like 25, 30 yards, I think, roughly. Don't don't quote me on that. I'm not too sure. I think it's around that. Jason Knight might as well have a shot as well. Oh, my God. I thought that went in. I thought that was going to be 2-0. All right. Well, last time we bought, uh, bought we bet Scotland 1-0 in the Aviva. 
this time, we're currently winning 1-0. Hopefully we can get a couple more because my goal difference seriously needs to start increasing. The work from Connolly. Uh, not exactly where I wanted that ball to go. In fact, it was nowhere near where I wanted that to go. That's a bit fucking shit. Fine, we're winning. There's no need to panic. Jason Knight, hit that. Oh, I just probably should have gone with your left. Fine. No need to panic. We're getting chances. Scotland are, like, well, they're they're in the game. They're not out of it. Uh, they do have, uh, they're not really chances, but they have opportunities to have chances. And they, stuff like that there. Or they're, like, they have a chance to, like, pass it and they just don't. Or um, my defense is just quality, which is strange for an Irish defense to be good. But, you know, believe it or not, this one is at the moment. Let's not get too cocky here. Oh, that's not where I aimed. I aimed for at Robinson, who was literally, like, two yards ahead. Like, you probably could have done a pass in it there where I asked. Jason Knight hit that. Ah, oh. that's, that's not quite what I wanted. All right, half time, 1-0. Could have been 2, possibly 3, but that's, that's a bit of a stretch. I think 2-0 would have been more accurate. We've had chances to score. We've scored one of them, which probably was one that shouldn't have gone in out of all the chances we've had. Um, yeah, Scotland have also had a chance to score, but they haven't had a shot. But they kind of... Not very good. Is this crosses or terrible passes at the final third that stopped them from threatening in any form? Oh, hello. Ah, oh, that was just too far ahead. Oh, that could have been a good chance for a second. That was a Scottish type of attack there where we just get to the last section and then just balls it up. See Callum Robinson there. I was hoping that we get him on the turn, but in fact we did not. While the team as a whole might be having a good game, Jason Knight is not. His shooting's been terrible and he's given the ball away several times, which is where they got the ball. That's why I started commentating. Yeah, so I think we're going to take him off, definitely. Oh, Ryan's lost the ball now. Uh-oh. He's one of my better players. Oh. Oh, what a fucking screamer. Yikes. I'm there complaining about Knight using, losing the ball. And it was actually Ryan who lost the ball. You know, if Knight didn't lose the ball in the first place, Ryan wouldn't have lost the ball there. Although there's no excuse in that. That was just fucking shocking. And what a good goal. I thought I'd have had that covered. Can we get, like, a shot from behind? Okay, this isn't necessarily the shot that I wanted. Oh, he probably should be saving that other one, if I'm being honest. Right. Well, I'm probably going to put the void there. Uh, Cullen here. I have a feeling we are going to score another one. Because we definitely are threatening. And two absolute belters have been scored this game. It's just a shame a midfield has gone to mush in the second half. It was okay in the first. Um, but then the second half, we just haven't been there. But... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not too concerned. As long as we win here. If we if we draw here, then we have to beat Spain. We want a chance of topping the group. Which, I don't really want it to come down to one fucking game. I kind of want to have a, a solid opportunity going into the final match against Spain. I think they're the final match. I might... They, oh, actually, they're up next. Oh, fuck. Well, I need someone looking for that. And he's not getting anyone. Where are my players? I know Phillips is another defender. That's fine. Well, defense midfielder. So I'm, not, I'm not blaming him for not being in position. Where's everyone else? Uh, I see Ryan here. That's that's fine. Here, hit that. Yeah, I was hoping for a penalty. If I'm being honest. I cannot switch to Connolly, who is acting as a left wing back. I could not switch to him for any of that move. That's a bit annoying. Not his fault, of course. Go on, drag him out. Class, class. Now, we need Ryan to move. Not there. I didn't want him to go that way. Fine, fuck, we'll pass to you. Hit that first time. Oh, good save. I don't think it was going in. All right, bringing Obafemi on. I don't think having Robinson on the pitch is doing much at the moment. And McMullen's also coming on. Ah, uh, God, I'm getting a bit of a headache here. Fine, no need to panic. We still have 30 minutes where we can score. Oh, we just scored from a corner. Oh, my God, we scored from a corner. Wow, holy shit. Okay, right, well, there's some very interesting things happening in uh, this game here. I think that's my second goal I scored from a corner in this career mode. Well, at least the part that went up to YouTube anyway, since I lost the first half. Oh, red card, is it? Yellow card for Osama 
Alamde, I cannot say his name. It's actually, like, I actually cannot say that. I, I just, my words get splished. Oh, fucking hell. Jesus Christ, let me finish the sentence before you have a shot like that. Nearly actually made me have an autism there. Get rid of it. What the fuck is that for clearance? That's just not what I said to do. Oh my god. Get rid of that. Fuck me. Send that into the next country. Holy shit. Oh, we've just been let away with it there. That was a terrible, terrible second half performance. The first half was quite good. The second half was fucking shocking. Oh my days. Yeah, a six. Yeah, that's that's fair. 7.9 from Dawson. The Who the fuck calls their child Dawson? Like, you're just begging them to be fucking bullied. However, he's a quality footballer, so I won't bully him for that. Although, I'll bully his parents for saying that. Spain drew a Poland. Oh. Oh, I believe we're... Oh. Oh, yeah, they have another game played, yeah. So, we should be within one point of them. However, I think... We're coming up against them next. Oh shit, we are. So if we win this, we're a point behind them with the same amount of games played. Oh, so that's that's interesting. This is a team I have playing against Spain. Last time it was a bit of a rotated side. This time I'm taking no chances. Parrot is up top instead of Robinson. And oh, who do I take off? Knight is off for Cullen, but I swap Cullen on the void. Okay, class. Oh, their team looks so good. Jesus Christ, I don't even need to see the ratings to know that they're absolutely class. Fine. We're going to get on with this. Let's let's go. Oh, that's a fell and a half there from whoever that was. From the Spanish player. Only three minutes into the game already. And they're going to be on a yellow card, guaranteed. Okay, I've made changes. Uh, the game's been pretty fucking boring. Um, yeah, we're going 5-4-1. Just so we can have a bit of stability at the back. Okay. Gotta get back into that happy voice. You know, I've been, been sitting here, waiting for something to happen, with a bit of a frown on my face, I can't lie. But, it's fine. That's where it would be grand. Although, the one thing I want to notice, or I want to point out, sorry, is that Parrot likes to go on the wing, the left wing. I don't know why, because he's a striker. He doesn't play left wing. He's never played left wing, I don't think. Well, in the game at least. So I don't know why he naturally goes out to the left wing. I'm, I'm not too sure. It's uh, it's not that big of a deal. But I know he's swapping with Conley. So he stays out on the left wing. But you know. I'm going to leave him up top for now. Higher rated than Conley. So I assume that, that means he's better. In theory it should. But it's fine. We'll see what happens. Not a lot clearly. I need to get an attack on fast. If I want to have a chance of scoring here. <sighs> Just hit it. Pass it. Foy, turn. Oh, you turned on the wrong side. I want you to cut in. All right, we'll just cross into the box. We might get lucky with a corner header. Ah, shit. Okay, maybe not quite. It's fine. Fine, a draw. Would I take it? Yeah, sure. It's not a loss. Um, A loss isn't even that bad of a result based off how many points we are ahead of Poland. Um... Yeah, but I'd, I'd rather get something out of this game. or Not potentially, but... I prefer a win. As always, of course. I never want to lose. Oh, I see a chance there. Oh, handball. Ref. Brian was fucking going to be true on goal. What the fuck? That was a handball. Watch me concede. What a load of bollocks that was. Alright, we're just going to cross. If, uh, hopefully Ryan can get on that. Why did he take a touch? Oh, it doesn't matter. He scored. Oh, Defoy with a great cross. And Ryan really made that from a great cross into a fucking wonderful cross. And I don't have my comb either, so I've got a bit of hair that's starting to go into my eye. What a what a nice shot. Great touch. I thought he fucked it there, but oh. Oh. I'm not necessarily going to say we deserve that. But it is very, very welcome. And I think I might just put a left back on now just to, just to sort us. I don't know, we could probably do it a second if I'm being realistic. Oh, yeah. Darrow Shea is getting fucked up the ass. I might put him centrally. Oh, ref, free kick. I was trying to get a penalty there. Didn't quite work. Is there anyone that needs to come off? No one needs to come off. 
probably do it putting Daryl Shea away from the team. Yeah, he can go left back for now. For now. Uh, I will be taking him off. Go on. Oh, that was such a good chance. All right, Connor, you're just going to go out on the wing here. Yeah, you might as well cross it. Go on. Oh, oh that was brilliant. Phillips nearly got made it 2-0. Oh, that probably would have sealed the deal. There, go on. Oh, who scored that? 25, Para. Oh, yes. Oh, we might top the group for the first time in this career mode. I don't think we're, we're yet to top a group in any competition we've been in. We haven't topped Conference League, I don't think. I think we finished second in that group. We finished second in the Europa League group. We finished second in the Champions League group. And then for the other qualifying rounds, I think we all finished second. Definitely for the World Cup group. I think the one before that, we didn't even qualify. Um, yeah, Jesus Christ. This is... This is very good. This is This is good. Now, obviously, there's not a guarantee we're going to finish first. We are still currently second, even with this result. But it gives us a very close opportunity to top this table. And really, yeah, stamp our, stamp our authority onto the Euros. If we win this group, we have a very good chance to win the whole tournament. And what a success that would be. Oh, shit. Oh, they've hit the post. Okay, right. Well, that just shows that this game isn't over yet. Darrow Shea has... Willingly giving the ball back to the Spaniards. I'm a bit nervous now what these blokes are going to do. Okay, Daryl Shea won the ball back with a slide tackle. That was quite good and then uh, immediately loses it. Not that it was his fault. That was just the game just losing it. Oh, ref. Jesus Christ. No care. No nothing. Oh, that's a bit dirty. All right, Obafemi's on for Phillips. Uh, Devoy is now in the middle. Uh, O'Shea is off. McMullen's on. I don't really have any other changes that I want to make, but we might as well stick on Robinson for Parrot because they, I think I think we're safe uh, for this game. I think we've won it. All right, well, this game is over. I want to see if I can nick one at the last second. There's no one up there with him. Oh, there is. Is there a chance for one? I'm just leaving it up there. I doubt it. Yeah, nah. All right, Ref, you can blow up. I'm not going to get third. Uh, We're not going to top the group with this game but we'll be second on one point behind spain so they bet us in i assume it was madrid we bet them in dublin so i'm happy enough with that now in terms of man of the match if anyone wants to take over the what what how the fuck did he score he didn't even score although he did get two assists i suppose okay right well as it stands devoy is going to be our player of the qualifiers and will be our captain going into the euros Unless Ryan wants to whip out another fantastic performance out of his heirs or Odomosu. Wow, that's that's a shocker. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, Youth Squad monthly report. Who have we got? Oh, Jesus Christ. No, thank you. Morrissey, yep. Quite good. McFay, I'm waiting for him to become 60 before I, uh, before I shit the bed. And Rooney is not quite there. His rating's fine, but, you know, his potential isn't necessarily great. Problem with scouts, right, is that they're not very good. Like they're all low rated, and you don't really get a good variety of positions. But I don't think we've had a centre back. I think I've converted players to centre back. Like that's it's it's fine with the conversion stuff, but you know it's a bit shit. I think I might just convert Morrissey right now into a centre back just to stop that. And then once he becomes a centre back, I'll probably promote him. All right, second team is playing because we have. Uh, the Champions League quarterfinals coming up. I swear to fuck, if we lose, I'm not going to be happy. We're in a lot of trouble. We are in a lot of trouble. I'm going to have to start playing league games. Or playing the first team. And I don't like the fact that I have to do that. 